Hi, and welcome back to the Infected. So we have 4,000 power stored left over. That is awesome. That's with the pump jack, the fridge, and the stone grinder all running. So a few more batteries, some more solar panels, and I think we should actually be good to go. That would be perfect. But I do want to include at least another fridge in this situation. So yeah, we're still going to play it by watching our levels and everything like that but yeah i think uh, we should be just about ready to start stocking up the fridge and uh you know what i think that's what we're gonna do with these two eggs we're gonna throw those into the fridge so that we could stop the timer on them uh here that 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 is perfect and we are going to go and look for some chickens today. Going to get a couple of other things done that need to be done. We're going to get the ghost imprints going for the, the gates on all three sides. At least get the ghost imprints up so that we can turn around and say, okay, now we got to work on this. We're also going to probably hit up the lead cave because we're going to have to grab some lead. And, uh... I'm not sure if there's going to be any time, but if there's time even after that, we might go hit up copper, but copper might have to wait till the next episode. But first things first, let's go and get a ration pack, eat that, and get our max health up to <laughs> where it's supposed to be because, yeah, even that didn't help us. So we'll eat that. And I am going to go over here. And what we're going to do is we're going to grab one veggie salad and one fruit salad. We're going to eat that up just to help increase our stats a little bit more. So there we go. That is done. That is perfect. We still need some water, as you can see. We do have that. There we go. And look at that view. I love that. Let me just take this away here. Yeah, I don't want to hear that. But yeah, look at that. Like This is a really nice view. And even if we go over here and just look at it, you know, this is, this is really, really nice. I, I like it. I'm happy with this. But yeah, let's bring back our interface here and you're good. Let's empty you out because uh, again, you've got way too much stuff in you. Wow. That's a lot of sand. good hopefully we are going to be able to find some chickens because we really really need them oh dear uh, uh name you sa sa sure sand <laughs> that works for me and then we'll go in the back here and we are going to name you Sand as well. <laughs> there we go. Oh dear. Uh, here, you could go there. We'll take you downstairs because it's going to be faster to take you down than it is going to be for us to waddle down there going super slow and then making our way back up. So here, we can go here. Actually, can we... Enough for 20. 3, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I think we can. Okay, so we got uh, iron and steel here. Okay, that. Oh, yeah, we still had that. That's supposed to be our next load. <laughs> Oops. Um, Yes, we will take care of that for the next load. Steel, you can go in here. Not so bad. So let's go put this back upstairs. Hopefully by the time we come back down, those should be ready so we can get that box emptied. Because again, that stuff's not supposed to be in that box. So you're good. Let's just uh, pop you up completely here. Okay, there we go. It's happy. We're happy. Everyone's happy. 
We'll be even happier when we take this stuff out of here. There we go. That's so much better. Huh? Didn't we already have a Vambi attack? Was it the bird? It had to have been the bird because that sounded like it came from over here. It sounded very close. Now I have to go and investigate. I know at one point the birds were able to cause damage to them, but... Wow. Bird. I'm gonna come here again. I want to see. It has to have been. Oh, uh, we still have this guy buried under there. We still got that one over there. I think that one keeps moving further away. I'm pretty sure she was like over here at one point. I don't know anymore. It's just really weird. Okay, so yeah, let's uh get this part taken care of. One, two, three, four, five. I need five of something. Five. Five of you? There. That works. Okay. We're good. Oh. Did I really do that? I did do that. Okay. You can go in there. I've done that before. And I'll probably end up doing it again at some point. <laughs> Um, yes. So I haven't heard any chickens yet. This should wake up a Vambi. Yeah. Hello, buddy. Okay. Okay, you wanted to do it that way. <laughs> That's fine with me. Others. Metal gates. So we want to put this the proper way. And that looks straight to me. Gonna raise it as much as we can. I don't think we can raise it much. Uh, it's gotta be at a certain spot. Yeah. No, come back. Okay, right there. Yeah, we can't raise it or anything, but that's okay. Because that still looks good either way. Oh! Forgot about that. Doesn't work like that. You destroy your traps with the ghost imprints of this. I completely forgot about that. Um. Okay, so you're you're straight. Right? You're straight? Yeah, you're straight. Now I just want to make sure I get it even on both sides. There. Yeah, see, look. <laughs> you can completely destroy your trap with this. Whether it's ghost imprint or not, it will still destroy your trap. Okay, so you're good. Uh, that works for me. That's going to look good because then what we're going to do is we're going to move these spike traps out of the way because these things got like 2,500 health. That's a lot of health. So we're going to have to pay more attention and go out and get them rather than just let them run into these traps. If they do want to run into the traps, that's their own doing, <laughs> but they're going to have access to the gate. So, yeah, this needs 75 iron. So we're looking at 225 iron plus an additional 30 for the mechanical parts and 75 screws. That's not so bad. That's only eight copper, but we are looking at 255 iron ingots for all three gates. So, yeah, this is going to be fun. Um... That's why we have to keep that stone grinder going at all times now. 
Because this holds what? Uh, 20, 40, 60, 80. We've got 200 that we could put here. So we could fill this up and then start all over again. But uh, we are definitely not going to have enough room for all of it here. Yeah. But I'm okay with that. That's fine. I'm good. We will just keep on making as many as we can. So we've got five. Okay, copper is completely out. We're going to take the 10 lead. And we will put that into lead. We're just going to smelt down everything we have at the moment. Okay, so you're good. And I still have not heard a chicken, so we are going to have to go out far and wide to look for one. Aluminum and steel. Steel and aluminum. Perfect. Okay. Where are you going? Come back. So we'll take our cart with us. And we are going to go and look. Oh, wait. How much oil do we have? Oh, we're up to eight. So we still need another 30 oil just to take care of the batteries that we do have. Yeah, this guy is moving too. So it's like things are slowly moving off to the side. I don't get it, but you know what? It is what it is, and I'm not going to complain. So this is good. That is good. I'm liking that. You're a raccoon. Lead me to chickens. Chickens, please. Yeah, we really need a bunch of chickens. And they should have been out by now. We're in March. Water is water. It's not frozen, so. I'm just taking the cart with me in case I come across an animal that I got to bring back. Now that we have a fridge, we could put some liver in there. Chicky, chicky. No? You know what? We'll check on the side of the house there where normally we find them. <gasps> Never mind. Scratch that. We found our first victim. Stop moving. I don't want to throw this unless he stops. There we go. Yeah, because if we try when he's still walking, chances are... I'll do my usual miss and uh, we'll be running for quite a while to try to find my spear. That's if it doesn't go way out. <laughs> and yeah, I'd, at, at that point, I'd probably just make a new one. Chicky chicky. Okay, so we'll check along the sides here. Maybe we'll find some more. We need more ration packs. We still need to get our stats up to like that 150 mark. But we're looking pretty good. Like even our water is at 111. That's not bad. Mind you, we could make some onion soup, but that only lasts for four hours again. This is why we need at least a second fridge for things like that. Uh, anything... I'm not hearing a chicken in the background at all. Huh. Maybe because of the rain? I know it doesn't usually stop them from coming out, but... I don't know. Well, very strange. Okay, you know what? Let's head back. We're not finding anything. No deers, 
We've seen that one raccoon, no bears, um, and only the one chicken. So yeah, we'll head back and we will start harvesting the animals that we do have. And we'll go from there. If I could figure out which way I'm going. That way. <laughs> oh dear. Oh! Perfect. Got him. Number two. Oh, I'm glad we came back. We have more though. Yeah, I'm convinced that these vampires are moving. Okay, let's go harvest these guys up. We'll put the eggs into the fridge. Uh, we have what, 10 animals? So 10 livers right there. Oh, where am I going? You stay here. Wait, 10? Ah, oh, you know what? We could probably turn them into the mini pizza straight away and not cook them. And by mini pizzas, I mean to, um, the meats to mix. Okay, so you can go in here. Because we have a bunch of potatoes and we have a bunch of onions. So why not? And that will take up one shelf instead of having to go and look for some meat to take care of it because you need... A meat to go with it. You need one liver, one meat, an onion, and a potato. So yeah. It just makes sense we get it done at the same time. Okay, that works for me. I can be smart sometimes. <laughs> Here. Let's do this. So we'll put you in here. We'll just put everything in here for now. Uh, no, except for that. That stays with us. I will come back and grab everything. And you. Oh, but wait a minute. We have, um, we have a piggy. And again, we're not ready for that yet. We still need more eggs to take care of that. Do we? Wait a minute. Wait for it. Itempedia. Food and drinks. You need one egg. One. That's ten pieces of bacon. Get where I'm coming from? Yes. Did I put everything away? Okay. Um, yes. <laughs> We've got a fridge. Remember this. Uh, here. Perfect. Well, hello. Get this bear off my table. And you can go over here. And let's start putting you in here. Oh, I've got no more room for you. Here, let's fix this up because it does look like a disaster. Um, there we go. Oh, that looks great. It'll look a lot better, but we'll leave it like that. Yes, we're going to do the bacon. The poor piggy has been there for a while. I'm surprised he's still edible at this point. Go. That. We need a lot of chickens still. A lot of chickens. There's the bacon. Oh, that's great. That's great. Let's keep this going. That. Last one. 
Okay, here we go. We'll wash our hands off. Awesome. Take that out of our hands. We shall take the liver and a piece of meat for each one. And that. And we are going to go and dump the hides and that in the box in a second. And that. And all the bacon is coming with us. Because it's a bacon. Uh-oh. No. Okay. We're almost there. We're good. We're good. You can go there. That is perfect. And that. And that. Okay. We're good. Let us go. And take care of what we got to take care of over here. So first off, we've got way too much stuff on us. I do have an empty box in here that I could just throw the bacon into for now. And we need... Here, let's just throw all that in here. So what we need is 10 onions and 10 potatoes. So let's go and grab that. We definitely have the onions and potatoes. Oh, yeah, see, some stuff is going bad. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, two, four, six, seven, ten, ten. So now we uh, figure out how to do this. <laughs> yeah, okay, that'll work. Pull it back and forth, but it's all good. Once I can get my head wrapped around this little mess I have going in my box here. Um, yeah. <laughs> it's usually a little more organized than this, but uh, it didn't turn out that way this time. Grab the rest of this and that. And just to make things a little easier. There. You guys go in here. And close the fridge so we don't let all that cold air out. There. Put the onions at the top. Just so it's a little easier. Just run down the line. Okay, that is a lot less of a mess. Great. And you. Okay, that is perfect. So we've got 10 of those done. So that will fill this up. Now we've got uh, six eggs. And we've got a lot of bacon. So what else did we need? Was it potato and onion? Um, yeah, okay. So we need 10 more potatoes and 10 more onions. Wait, no. I've only got six eggs. Six potatoes and six onions. Unless we can go find some more chicky chickies. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six... One, two, three, four, five, and six. Here you go, buddy. That is perfect. When we do decide to run over for copper, we'll look for some more chickens again. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Just take all these eggs out. And we could put the remainder of the bacon into the fridge after we're done. We should be able to fill up the top shelf there. See, this isn't as bad of a mess. <laughs> this is manageable. 
that last thing I had going there, I don't know what I was thinking. Uh, and bacon. Okay, that is good. Uh, put you in here. Wait. Thank you. This is going to work perfectly. Like, we could cook this. But look at the way it is. You can see this, the onion and you can tell the egg. It just looks so funny. Like, why is the potato so super small compared? <laughs> like, the potato is that little tiny thing in the background there. And you, and you. Okay, I feel really good about this. We're still good. Stone grinder, how are you doing? Oh, you're almost out. We do not want you to run out at all. And that means I'm probably going to have to go and collect some stones. Oh. Well, hopefully once we go and get copper, we should have enough to come back with. Uh, let's see. One, two, three. That is perfect. Okay, so we've got that done. We've got that done. We've got these up. And we need to find some chickens. Where are our chickens? This is doing good. Okay, not so bad. Ah, uh, chicken, chicken, chicken. <gasps> I didn't even hear him yet. There we go. Two more. Uh, no, this. Oh, dear. I think we have to fix our tools. Probably would be a good idea to take care of that as soon as we get back. Yeah, I'm just going to run around like this without the cart. We'll try to avoid any animals. But when we do go and get the copper, we're going to have to take the cart with not the stone crates, but with like um, an extra storage crate with us because we've got four extractors over there. And if they're all full, well, you know how that's going to turn out. <laughs> and if we run into an animal, well, we're going to have to take him back with us. Come on, I need more chicken. seeing any that way let's go and check back over there now that it's not raining maybe there's more chicken out now where are you guys hiding i need like two more eggs just to cover the bacon so one more chicken just for that and then we need a bunch just to cover for the, what do you call it there? Um, yes, that. Uh, <laughs> the uh, ration packs. Yes, yes, that. I think I would have remembered. But I couldn't. <laughs> Mind you, we can always just eat the, the meat stew like that. Like, just cook it up and eat it so all it'll do is it'll do the same amount of health but it won't hit everything it will just hit the health no luck might have better luck in the next episode though like i said going over to copper I'll probably run into a few chickens on the way that could work Nothing. Huh. Well, it seems our chickens are hiding from us. And I really don't blame them. 
Those poor things. They're like, oh no, she's out again. There goes one of my friends. No. Yeah. They're trying to figure out where all their friends are going. Hmm. Interesting. There's days that you have a lot of chickens and then days that you don't have really anything. Again, I'm still not hearing any deer. We had that one raccoon and two chickens now. <laughs> but neither of those chickens were near our house. We had to go out looking for them. You guys over here? Are you hiding on this side? There's a raccoon. Chicky, chicky. No. Oh, this is a nice view as well. I heard you. I believe this is where one of my viewers have their base set up is here. It looks similar to where we are. <laughs> I love it. It does look good here. But I need my chickens and they're really playing hide and go seek with me. So they're hiding really well and I'm just poorly seeking. Where are you guys? Now, the thing about running is I may not hear them unless it's been the amount of time for that noise to come out. <laughs> I can't remember. I think it's 25 seconds. Every 25 seconds, they'll make their noise. And it's only at a certain distance. I'm not certain what the distance is, but it's it's fairly close. But I think at one point, like, the noise was every 10 seconds, and it was, like, constant, and it really got annoying at points. Mind you, when it was every 10 seconds, a bear couldn't sneak up on you. Another raccoon? Yeah, bear couldn't sneak up on you when it was every 10 seconds, because you would hear it from a little away. But now, by the time uh, you hear the bear, you're almost right on his tails. Or he's right on yours. Oh, found one. Hello, buddy. Can we get him from here? Yes. Thank you, buddy. Greatly appreciate it. Your eggs will not go in vain. We will take proper care of them. So that covers the bacon pie mix. So that'll be awesome. So let's get back home, see what else we have to get done. And we'll call it there. Definitely the next episode, we will be heading off over to Copper. Checking it out because now that we have the pump jack, we don't have to worry about this stuff running out. There's nothing here. Oh, I heard a deer. I think he's that way. <laughs> But yeah, see, there's nothing here. So when the pump jack is off, it'll come back and it'll tell you like that you need to add the fuel and things like that. But now we don't have to worry about that. It's not like this anymore. So let's see where we are sitting at with that stone grinder. We probably have to empty it yet again. But before we do that, we need four more potatoes. Wait, not that way. Uh, four potatoes and four onions. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Do we really only have one onion left? Wow. Okay, that is not bad. So we've used up almost every onion that we took out of the greenhouse the other day. <laughs> so that is perfect. 
Okay, so I need to take you guys out. And you. Awesome. Go to this table. Ah, oh, bacon, bacon, bacon. This is great. Okay. Let's go put that away. So what we'll do is uh, get that cooked up. We should probably make like two more pots and two more pans. That's what I'm going to go do. Two pots and two pans. I should have the iron to cover that. Just need 10. And 10 we have. And those have gone out. That's okay. <laughs> so one, two, three. One, two, three, two, and one, two. Perfect. Okay, that's good. That works for me. Because now I can cook four th things in a frying pan at once, which will completely speed up cooking. And we can also make... Oh, no, that doesn't go there. We can also make um, four onion soup at once. So, yeah, we are going to get on that shortly. Uh, we're going to cook this up first. Just in case we do come across a lot of, uh, what do you call it there? There. Oh. A lot of the chickens on our way to copper. If not, then we'll just cook them up and eat them like that. Three and four. Light you up. You can cook. That is perfect. Um... Yeah, we'll throw that in here. Feathers, you can go in here. And the pots, we can put in here. Okay, that works for me. That really does. So we have to start ripping these walls out. So you know what? We will do that now. Okay. Okay, that's good. I didn't even realize we still had this campfire here. <laughs> this is good. Again, that log went flying somewhere. And like I said, we can move these. So that's what we will do. That's good. So we'll put you here. And you go to the fridge. We can always move the fridge so the wire's not through everything. And you are the one for the water. Or the oil. So if we put you here. Yeah, see? Now the fridge is just sitting there. But that's okay. We could deal with that by doing this. That. Turn the fridge. And if we put the fridge... Where will you fit? If we put the fridge like right here, <laughs> we don't see any wires anymore. <laughs> but we are going to sort this out. Um, Here. Just go here for now. Oh. Um, yes. <laughs> Hold on. We got food cooking. That's not going to help. I can't see. Two... Three and four. I figured, why not? We might as well get those walls taken down. It's been long enough. That's good. Oh, wait. That's not good. Two. Three and four. You're awesome. That. You. And you. And we might as well take these two out, because it uh, shouldn't take long for those to cook. Again, the power is starting to come down. It is past eight. We are still sitting pretty here. Our stone grinder should still be going. Uh, got a couple of logs, I think, upstairs that we're going to have to go and get. That's okay. 
We'll go and get those. Stone grinder, how are you looking? Yeah, okay. So you are completely out. This is all we have left. Oh, look at all that sand. That is crazy. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I forgot we got those planks on us. That's from tearing down the walls and the doors. We get half of everything back, which is great. Sand. Okay. Oh. Still had a lot of sand in there. Wow. That's a lot. Um. I think we're gonna have to start working on the, the concrete <laughs> very soon. Okay, so you're done. And you are perfect. No. Ah, oh, cap locks is on. Why is it on? Keep hitting that button. Another 20 sand. Come on. Give me a break. Okay. You here. Can we walk it? No. No, we can. Come with me. Stay there. Planks. We're just going to get everything cleaned up so that uh, we're ready to go in the morning. This all in here. Perfect. Okay. You can get up there and we'll go see if we can find those missing logs. Shouldn't be too hard to spot. There's one. There's two. Yay! Would have been helpful if I actually picked it up. And you. Okay, so that's not so bad. It's getting there. So we'll put you here. Everything looks good. Let's just take that off of there. Take that off of there. Um, iron. That looks terrible. Okay, that's better. And lead. Ah, oh, that is perfect. So we still have to do our lead run, our copper run, and look for some more chickens. But I am going to end it there. And on that note, I wish you guys a good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. And I'll see you in the next episode. Take care.